Okay, this is a sunflower, and the reason I'm showing the sunflower is because it is a perfect example of symbiosis. On the back of the sunflower and crawling all around it are ants. And you can also see a whole bunch of little black dots. Those black dots are another insect called aphids. Now the relationship between the ants and the aphids is one where both species benefit. So this type of symbiosis is called mutualism. The aphids have mouth parts for, for piercing the plant and for sucking out the juice, and the ants don't. So what the ants do is they actually farm the aphids. They move them around the plant they actually uh, protect the eggs over the winter and the ants get the sweet juice after it passes through the aphid so they use the aphids to get the juice from the plant um, it's been uh, documented that ants have bitten the wings off of aphids before to prevent them from flying away and the ants also produce a, a chemical which acts a bit like a tranquilizer and numbs the aphids so they can't go anywhere. Uh, despite that though, this is still seen as a relationship where both species benefit because the aphids do get protection from other predators such as ladybugs and they do get food from the plant. So it is called mutualism. It's also an example of another type of symbiosis. If we, if we look at the relationship between the aphids and the plant, uh, that is a parasitic relationship. So the aphids act like a, a parasite. They benefit, but the plant actually suffers.